What's going on YouTube, this is your boy Vintage. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. So, if you're looking at the thumbnail, you're right. The Nike 10 collection off-white collab is dropping tomorrow starting at 12 o'clock, man. Very, very dope. I'm glad they finally released these on the Sneakers app. First, it was acting like they wasn't gonna do it, and now they're actually doing their on the Sneakers app now. And I know everybody is going fucking crazy. So, I'm not gonna talk your head off. I wanna go over one major major key to getting this sneaker and that is on the sneakers app if you turn on your touch id man if you have an iphone the transaction will go through much faster everybody got an iphone so you would be putting yourself ahead of a lot of people who don't have iphones with that uh thumbprint as soon as you hit your size you're, you get in line and it's first come first serve and um the reason i'm telling you that because i finally did this tip that i really didn't think it would work when i tried to get the db12s that came out yesterday i copped i didn't let y'all know but i did cop the db12s i'm happy I cannot wait to put them in the in my collection. Can't wait to do a review on feet for the YouTube community. Yeah, more sneakers coming on the way. So if you turn on your touch ID and you already have your card information on there, all you have to do is select your size and hit, put your thumbprint on your phone. And you'll be one of the first to get in line, you know what I'm saying? So hopefully this technique works for me again on copying the off-white ones. And hopefully get the uh, Air Force One low. See, I know I fuck with Air Force Ones. Not a lot of people do. So I'm going to go after them and Air Force Ones. So, no, and the Air Jordan Ones. Hopefully I get them, man. Uh, the first sneaker that they got on there dropping at 12 o'clock is the Air Prestos. Put a picture right here, man. Um, all these shoes look crazy, but it will be a dope addition to a collection, you know what I'm saying? A collab with these, you know what I'm saying, these Nikes. These OG Nikes at that. Prestos, which Adidas stole the look of, in my opinion. They got an off-white collab, you know what I'm saying? That's that's just very dope. Check them out right here, Air Prestos. Next, we have the Blazer Mids right here. Not really feeling them as much, but like I said, I will add any of these sneakers in my collection if I can get them all for retail. Uh, also, we have the React Hyper Dunks. Y'all seen Devin Booker rocking these in the game. I think it was about a couple nights ago, and uh, y'all thought it was pretty dope for like a hooping shoe, but not, you know what I'm saying, not a casual shoe. Also, you have the Air Max 90s. These are probably the third best, in my opinion, behind the Air Force Ones and the Air Jordan Ones. Uh, very nice. I think I seen D-Wade rocking these going into the game against uh, the Clippers. Next, you have the Air Vapor Max. This is probably my least sought out after sneaker on this uh, collaboration just because it's, it's just plain, you know what I'm saying? All they like to put was a damn whatever that little clamp is around on the side of the shoe. But here I go right here. Y'all check that out. Also, we have... The second favorite, in my opinion, the Air Force One Lows, dropping at 1.30 tomorrow. Very nice, very different. And you've seen Odell Beckham Jr. rocking these, and they retailing for $170, which usually uh, Air Force One retail for $100. But uh, hey, it is what it is, that collaboration money, man. Uh, also, you have the Air Max 97s. Probably the second ugliest, or not even ugly, probably the second most favorite sneaker on this collaboration. They're retailing $190 over the Air Force Ones, which is crazy. You have the Zoom Flies. This is probably the ugliest one. This is probably the ugliest one, in my opinion. And they're retailing for, no, these are $170. And then last, but definitely not least, you have the Air Jordan Ones, man. This is probably gonna be the hardest one to get. Like, just because it's an Air Jordan One, and everybody is in love with Air Jordan Ones. It's the, the thing that started the whole sneaker culture. Honestly, if you think about it, these are the best ones. Like, no lie. Put in the description box below if you think these aren't the best ones. I can see how some people might say the Air Force Ones are better than the Air Jordan Ones, but hey, they like this right here. But I would still put the Air Jordan Ones over these. If somebody had to, if somebody handed you Air Jordan Ones or the Air Force One, which one would you take? It would definitely be the Air Jordan Ones for me. So, and these are retailing for $190. So, hey man, if y'all want to cop them, go ahead and download this Sneakers app. Uh, I do not know if they're dropping on any other sites. But the major one, the Sneakers app, is doing it. So hopefully we can cop. Hopefully everybody can get them. I ain't gonna lie. I want to put them in my collection, Air Force Ones and Air Jordan Ones. But if not, it is what it is, man. So if I do cop, look for that reaction video. I'm definitely gonna drop one. I should've did a reaction video on getting a DB12. So I really didn't think I was gonna get them. And uh, I got them. So hey, like I said, shouts out to the shoe guys. And hopefully we can bring these off-whites to the collection for the Air Force Ones. And there's one ones to be a dope review and on feature. I already know how I do. Go ahead and subscribe if you need to the channel. Follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. Hit that notification bell for your boy. And I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.